Hey guys, how are you? We just went from Las Vegas to Los Angeles and we hit a couple of key stops. Baker, the world's largest thermometer, you gotta stop there. Also, we stopped at Halloran Springs Road and the Hilltop Mart. It's an abandoned gas station. I've always driven by it and I've never stopped until now. And also Zizix Road. If you're in Southern California or Los Angeles, you know this place, but you've never stopped, have you? You've driven by a thousand times, you never stopped? We did, in the 55. And I think we cracked our transmission pan too. But anyways, we made it here safe and sound. Check out the video, let me know what you think. Just got the phone back, made a new friend out here, right off of uh, Halloran Springs Road. I-15 right back there, the 55, and check it out. Up top gas mart. Get a little shot of that. Those are my new friends, but uh, yeah, that's that was a shot. I'll post it up uh, without their thing in so you can see what it looks like. And now we're off. Here we go, we made it to Baker, California. Home to the what? It's home to the world's largest thermometer. Look at that thing. It's only registered in 71 degrees right now. It's the gateway to Death Valley. There we go. All right, I gotta get a picture. Yeah, if you know, you know. When you're on your way back to Cal to LA from Las Vegas, you always pass by Zizix Road. But I've never stopped at Zizix, Zizix Road. Have you? Exit 239. Zizix Road. Let's check it out. Springs, Mineral Springs, something like that. Beautiful scenery over there, kind of looks like salt flats. Adventures for sure. Day use area only, okay. Let's see what we got, Zizix Road. Making a turn. Mojave National Preserve, not a through road, no off road access, no camping. 25 miles an hour, okay. And driving the dry lake beds. It's a dry lake bed out here, check it out.
paved. It hasn't been maintained, but it seems like just a little bit of wind or a whole lot of wind. It's been blowing this up. It's probably water, actually. Yeah, sorry. There's a bunch of monsoons out here. Earlier this year, I know. Wow, it's gorgeous. Dry lake bed. My first time ever out here on Zizix Road. just drove in as you can see we just drove into the shade like literally almost night day difference and oh geez it looks like we drove yeah we drove into dirt uh, road onto a dirt road into dirt road the end of the line for me. Depends on how rough it is. attention put this down all right we got a little bit of light here and it looks as if oh glory me we're back to pavement but for how long let's take advantage look at that scenery and look at the light It'll be going down here in a little bit. Oh, look at that, just, just rounded that bend. Look at that, it's like an oasis up there. Can I zoom in? Wow, that's pretty cool. Palm trees coming up. More short little palm trees. Uh, looks like a stop sign up here. Minnesota Springs or the CSU Desert Study Center walking access during daylight hours. Look at that. All right. Soda Springs. Park and check it out. Welcome to the Desert Study Center. Scientists and students from around the world visit this California State University field station on the edge of the soda. Dry Lake in the Mojave Desert. Very interesting. Yeah, I've been by Zizix Road plenty of times, but I have never ever stopped there until today. This looks like lava rock. It's very windy, so sorry. Closed to public access. All right. I kind of feel like we're not wanted here. Which is why we should go in, but... So there are some buildings, solar panels. 
panels. Little lake or pond. So to spring, I guess it's a spring. So there you go. Soda Springs, Zizix Road. Thanks for coming along for the ride. I think it's always fun to check out something you've never seen. So, uh, yeah, thanks again for coming along for the ride. My name's Jeff Thiston. I drive a 55. Oh, yeah, give me a like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it.